Hello, everybody. Welcome to the continuation of the 2018 Colorado Rockies Stratomatic Super Advanced Replay. Today is game 120, the second of a two-game series against the Houston Astros in Houston. And today's pitching matchup is Tyler Anderson for the Rockies and Garrett Cole for the Astros. And we'll go and get started. Leading off and playing center field is Charlie Blackman. And a 6-6 six, six against the lefty is a swing and a miss strike three. And now bang the second baseman, DJ LeMayhew. At 3-8 is a long drive to uh, left center field. And it goes off the wall. And LeMayhew is in with a stand-up double. So Cole left one hanging and LeMayhew knew what to do with it. They will not hold him on. Here's Carlos Gonzalez playing right field. 2-10, rip down the third baseline, fair ball, and that'll get down in the corner. In the score is LeMahieu, and the Rockies are quickly out to a 1-0 lead. Excuse me, as I have a little bit of sniffles, I've just been cleaning a little bit. All right, so here's Nolan Arenado, and they will not hold Carlos Gonzalez on. 1-9. Fly ball to left. Just missed it. Under it is Marwin Gonzalez. One down, or two down, sorry. And here is Trevor Story. Shortstop. Oh, one. That's a 50-50 chance for a wild pitch. And the wrong side. So, nice stop by uh, Max Stassi. And here is Trevor Story. 6-5 uh, to the shortstop, Correa. 2-16 and a 16 will be an easy play. And there's, there's usually no a 10 out of 10, no. So Correa makes the nice uh, range play, throws the first in time. However, the Rockies do get out to a 1-0 lead. And Anderson will face the leadoff batter, the third baseman, Alex Bregman. And 5-4 is to the center fielder. That's Blackman, a 12. Ooh. He looks like he might get to it. Oops. Uh, let's see, a 1 and a 12. Great running catch by Charlie Blackman as he goes towards the wall. So uh, Anderson tips his cap to Blackman. It's one down. Here's Marwin Gonzalez. And a 4-6 uh, against a righty. Won't be so lucky this time. This gets over David Dahl's head. And into second is Marwin Gonzalez with a double. And here is Yuli Gurriel. They will not hold on Gonzalez. And that's a 12, so nothing there. 2-7. Fly ball to left. Oops. No, that's a ground ball to second. Sorry. <sighs> And Anderson's a lefty, so it's a ground ball to second. Easy play for LeMayhew. Gonzalez will go to third, but there are two outs. And here is Carlos Correa. And that's nothing to worry about there. 5-3 to the left fielder. Dahl. He's a 2, so 17 is going to be an easy play. Oof. 2 and a 13. Good play by Dahl, runs it down, and that will retire the side. The Astros leave a runner on third, and we go to the second. one nothing Rockies. And here is David Dahl. The left fielder. And a one ten, and Dahl rips one to the gap, and it's off the wall, and it bounces away from... Uh, Kemp, the center fielder, and into third with a triple is David Dahl. Wow. So leadoff runner on third. They'll just give up the try to do what they can here. Here's Ian Desmond, the first baseman. Nothing there. Three, seven. Oh, that's a 19. Oh, ground ball to third. Uh, Bregman looks back, Dahl one down, oof. And here's Ryan McMahon, 
Okay, no balk, and Stassi is a pass ball of four. Ooh, so four or less, and the Rockies will take a 2 nothing lead. That's a 10, so no, no dice there. All right, so here's Murray McMahon. Five, four, the catcher X. Uh, Stassi is a three and a 10. Okay, let's see if he makes an error, and then we'll have to roll against his wild pitch rating. Uh, one and an 11. No, he won't make an error on that. Okay, so now, three and a 10 is the good old PF, which is essentially you roll the wild pitch rating, I believe. Yes, so you have to roll if if the D this D20 roll is 10 or less, they will score. If not, it's just a pop-up. And that's a 17, so good stop by Stassi. And the next pitch, he throws the mask off. And actually, that's a foul pop, so we'll make that the F2. So Max Stassi helping out his pit, pitcher Cole. And there are two outs. Here's Chris Ionetta. There's a 10. Two, eight. Swing and a miss. Strike three. And Garrett Cole has pulled a, well, so we would say a Houdini act, but has pitched masterfully to get out of that jam. And here is Tyler Anderson facing Tyler White, first baseman. Uh, five, nine is a swing and a straight three, and that's the first strikeout of the day for Anderson. And here's Josh Reddick. Uh, five, ten is to the shortstop. That's Story. Uh, Fourteen and a thirteen is fine, so nice play by Story in the hole. Two down, and here is Evan Gaddis, the designated hitter. And a 4-7 is all four. And I'm going to pause the game real, real quick. Okay, I'm back. Ah, much better now. Okay, so Gaddis drew a two-out walk. And they will not hold him on. Here's Max Stassi. And that's a 5-7 to the second baseman, LeMayhew. We'll easily get to that, and a 5 and a 12 is a good play. And that will retire the side. Two complete in Houston, one nothing Rockies. And back to the top of the order for the Rockies. Here is Charlie Blackman struck out his first time up. And a 5-2 against the lefty. That's ground ball in the hole. Good play by uh, Guriel. Throws the first in time. So here is DJ LeMahieu. By the way, reminder, ballpark singles are a 1. Ballpark homers, lefty 1-8 to eight, and 1-11 to 11 for righties. 4-4 four, four to the center fielder. Uh, Kemp a 4-16. He'll, he'll run that down. Let's see if he makes the catch. Two and a nine, that should be fine. Yep, good play by uh, Tony Kemp. And he'll run it down. And here is uh, Carlos Gonzalez. Double his first time up. And 4-11 lefty is a ground ball to second. Guriel makes the play, and that will retire the side in order. We go to the bottom of the third, one nothing Rockies. Here is Tony Kemp. Uh, four, six against a lefty, and that's a nine, so it's drilled into the gap, cut off, and Kemp has a leadoff single. They will hold him on um, in one to 14. They probably won't take that chance with Bregman up. Four, five, maybe they should have. Ground ball to short. Story to LeMayhew. On to Desmond. Double play. 
And here is Marwin Gonzalez. Don't need that anymore. And that's a foul ball, so we'll reroll. Uh, four nine against a righty is a ground ball to third. Up with it is McMahon, and that will retire the side. Three complete here in Houston, one nothing Rockies. And here is Nolan Arenado. Three tens a fly ball to right. One down. And here is Curra Story. Four nine. Swing and a miss. Strike three. And here is David Dahl. Four seven. Lefty. Swing and a miss. Strike three. And that will retire the side. Go to the bottom half of the fourth. One nothing. Rockies. And here is Carlos Correa. Two, six, oh, that's outside ball four. And okay, it's a missed phone call. I'll take that later. And here is. Carlos Correa. Six, eight, righty, swing and a miss, strike three. And here is Tyler White, first baseman. Four, seven against the righty, that's ball four, so two on with one out. Here is Josh Reddick, the right fielder. Four eleven. That's a left against a lefty. Doesn't matter. Any ballpark single is gonna be for naught, unless it's a one. So caught by the second baseman LeMahieu, two down. And here is Evan Gaddis. Three four. That's ball four, so he's walked the bases loaded. And there are two outs here. So here's Max Stassi, the catcher. See if the Astros can blow this inning open here. Three, three, nope. Ground ball to third. And McMahon throws him out, and the Astros leave him loaded. Four complete, one nothing. Houston, and here is Ian Desmond, 5-4 to the catcher, Stassi, 1 and a 9, that'll be fine, uh, 3 and a, f 3 and a 14, high pop up in front of home plate, throws off the masks, and mask and will retire the side. Or not retire, side retire Desmond. Here's McMahon. Four, five. Lefty swing and a miss, strike three. And here is Chris Ionetta. One, ten. Doesn't matter, that's a 16. So line drive caught by the shortstop, and that will retire the side. We go to the bottom of the fifth. And it's one nothing. Rockies. Here's Tony Kemp. One five. Outside ball four. And this time I don't think they're going to mess around. They're going to try to get a lead. So he needs a two through five. And nope, that ain't going to happen. So they will not, hold, they will hold on Kemp, but he will not be going anywhere. Here is Bregman. Uh, do they want to do a hit? Nah, they'll just swing the stick there. Three, three. And that's a three, but that's a line drive caught by the shortstop. Maybe thought about doing the hit and run there. Nah. 
All right, here's Marwin Gonzalez. That's a six. Four, seven. Batting from the right side. Ball four. And these walks may soon come back to haunt Anderson. Uh, let's see here. Uh, they will hold on all runners. Here's Guriel. Oh, two. Balk of four. Wild pitch a zero. Or pass ball a zero. Pass ball zero. So. Five, nine. Righty strike three. So two down. Here's Carlos Correa. That's a five. Five, seven. That's five. Uh, ground ball to second. LeMahieu makes the great play. And five and a seven. There is no seven. Great play by LeMahieu. And that will retire the side. Astros leave two. And we are through five. One nothing Rockies. Here is Cole, third time through the lineup, so this might they might keep an eye on him. Here's Charlie Blackman, 0 for 2 on the day. Or 4 to the center fielder, Kemp, 4 to 16, will get the job done. Uh, 2 and a 13. That'll be okay as well, so Kemp runs it down. One out, and here's DJ LeMahieu. Now that's a foul ball. One seven ground ball back to the pitcher call, and he'll take it to the bag himself. One down or two down or take it to the first. Sorry, one down or two down. And here is Carlos Gonzalez. Three five outside ball four. And Cole. Let's see, Stassi is a zero. Oh, they don't. Let's see. Four. Zero. He'd be a plus four. They don't hold him on. So they're going to hold him on. He'd be a plus two. They have to roll a seven. Nope. And Gonzalez gets back. And here's Nolan Arenado. That's an 11. So. Nothing there. 210. That's a 15, so that's a line drive caught by the shortstop, and that will retire the side. Going to the bottom of the six. Oof. Uh, yeah, this might be... <sighs> yeah, this will probably be it for Anderson, so... Harrison Musgrave and Chris Roussin are loosening in the pen. One five against the lefty. That's a 13, so that's a base hit. And here is Josh Reddick. Maybe just leave him in for one more batter. Famous last words. Uh oh. 16. Good stop by Ionetta. Two eight. Line drive caught by the shortstop. Story one down. And four six against the righty. That's a fifteen. That'll get down. Uh White does not run very well, and he was not being held on. One to eleven. This is the center fielder, Blackman, one to twelve. Do they want to take the risk? No, not with two runners in scoring position, so they will hold white. And that'll be it for Tyler Anderson. And here comes Harrison Musgrave. So second and third, the infield will be in. Leading one nothing with one out. So here's the pitch to Musgrave for Musgrave to Stassi. 
one, five, lefty swing and a miss, strike three. And here's Tony Kemp on base twice today, so. And here's the pitch to Tony Kemp. Six, five to the shortstop, Story. Nine, 14 out of nine. No nine, so good play by Story. And once again, the Astros missed opportunities. Leave, leave two, and we go to the top of the seventh. Uh, Cole, Ryan Presley is loosen, loosening. They might let him go through this part of the seven. One ten ground ball to third. Easy play for Brugman. One down, and here's David Dahl. One eight ground ball back to the mound. And two down, and here is Ian Desmond. 5 11, that's a 15, so that's a line drive caught by the shortstop, and that will retire the side. Stretch time here in Houston. Take me out to the ball game. Take me out with the crowd. Buy me some peanuts and some Cracker Jack. I don't care if I never get back for it's root, root, root for your favorite team. If they don't win, it's a shame. For it's one, two, three streaks throughout the old ball game. Okay, so here is Musgrave. He'll stay out to pitch the seventh inning. And here is Bregman. 2 5 against the lefty base hit. So, first hit of the day for Bregman. And Roussan is loosening in the pen. One with Adam Adavino. 5 10. That's the catcher X. Ionetta 4 and a 16. Might actually be a pop up. 4 and a 16. No. So, a 7 and an E1. No. So, 16. So that wonderful PF rating is going to come in again. And so we roll against uh, Musgrave's wild pitch rating. Oh, nice stop by Ionetta. And this is a pop foul. And Ionetta makes the play. And so two uh, one down. And here is, and what is it? maybe the Bregman take off. Eh, minus three, minus one, minus three. Nah, they'll, they'll hold him on. But Guriel will play the hit and run. Let's run the wild pitch scenario first. Nope. Okay, so here is the pitch to Guriel. Bregman takes off. And a 4-5. Now a strikeout. No, actually fly ball center field. Will just be a fly ball center field. So, and hurrying back is uh, Bregman, two down. And here's Carlos Correa, four, eight. That's a five. And so it's a fly ball to center caught by Blackman, and that will retire the side. We go to the eighth. Um, hmm. Ryan Presley will come in to try to help out. And Cole pitches seven innings. He faced 25 batters. So here is Presley. Who was also in my Minnesota Twins replay in 2016. All right, here is Ryan McMahon leading off. 3-9 against a righty swing on a strike three. And here is uh, Chris Ionetta. 1-9, uh, that's a swing on a strike three. And here is, back to the top of the order, Charlie Blackman, 0 for 3 on the day. 6-5 uh, against the lefty, that's a swing and a miss, and Presley comes in and strikes out the side. And, uh, they will get Will Harris loosening in the pen. 
Uh, Musgrave will not come out for the bottom of the... Sorry, that retires the side in the eighth. We go to the bottom half, one nothing. Rockies. Uh, Roussan will come in and pitch the eighth. Uh, Wade Davis is also loosening. He will be ready if needed. All right, so here is Roussan. Two, six against the lefty, and White goes ball four, so he's walked for the second time today. Well, they will not hold him on. Here is two, six, walk. Okay. Here is Josh Reddick. Four, eight, well, against the lefty, that's a swing and a miss, strike three. And Reddick's 0 for 4 on the day. Here's Evan Gaddis. Nothing there. Six, four to the shortstop. Oh, this could be exactly what the doctor ordered for the uh, one and a six. Okay. Story, can you turn two? 14 and an 11. Yes, he can. Story, good play to LeMahieu, and LeMahieu turns the double play. And we go to the ninth. Will Harris will come in, and Wade Davis is loosening. He will come into the ninth if it is a save situation. And here is LeMahieu facing Will Harris. Two, seven, four, a ground ball is short. One down. Here's Carlos Gonzalez. And six, five is a swing and a miss, strike three. And here is Nolan Arenado, 0 for three on the day. Five, eight, that's a six, so fly ball to left. Gonzalez runs it down, and that will retire the side. We go to the bottom of the ninth. The Rockies cling to a one nothing lead, and here comes Wade Davis. He will face the bottom of the order, Stassi, Kemp, and then back to the top of the order in Bregman. And 4-11, that's a 20, so no dice there for the ballpark home run. That's a fly ball to deep left, but room for Dahl, and he makes the catch. And here's Tony Kemp. 6-9 against the lefty, swing and a miss, strike three. And last hope for the Astros is Alex Bregman. 5-8, swing and a miss, strike three, and that will end the ball game. Final score from Houston. They must have really wanted to play a, a quick get getaway day game. one nothing Houston. I'm sorry, one nothing Rockies. Back-to-back uh, -back doubles in the first inning, and that held up. Um, Mark, uh, no, not Marcus. Anderson goes five in the third and gets the win, and Davis gets the save. Cole goes seven in the loss. All right, that's it for this series. Uh, the next series will be, actually the next game will finish off my Cleveland Indians 14 game winning streak against the Blue Jays. And then following that up, I will go back to my more normal schedule. Um, in fact, I don't, we'll see. Uh, do, do, do. The next games are against the Atlanta Braves. Four games set. Uh, looks like we'll go game three. Maybe we'll go game three and game four. Game three is Antonio Sanzatella against Mike fulton And game four is uh, Herman Marquez and Anibal Sanchez. And then after that will be a three-game set against the uh, San Diego Padres. I'll probably only bring one, one of those. 
And then the after a long hiatus, another uh, Rockies week in simulation baseball. Okay. All right, everybody. Thank you for watching. Make sure you hit the like button. And if you're watching for the first time or have not subscribed, uh, please hit that subscribe button and make sure you hit that bell icon. You'll be notified of any new videos. And whatever games you are playing, may your games be lively and your games be good. Have a good day, everybody.